let's find a cozy spot that we know Shilonen would appreciate to pull for her. First of all, obviously, this is it's. We need we need some sun. She likes to sunbathe, obviously. Ladies like her, they like to sunbathe, baby. It's what they do. Uh, so either like a, a tall tree, or we can go to where she does music. I mean, we're close to her place. That's pretty good. Should I go on the high ground, maybe? That would be good, but they don't have a little... Oh, there it is. Haha. Hee hee. Woohoo! Boop. F to enter. Come on. Just go straight up. Oh! Woo! Okay. Close to her home. Big place. Like, I could see her laying down here and just, you know, sleeping under the sun. Have a good time sunbathing. There's so much wind. What the frick? All right, maybe under the tree right there. Like, oh, that's the spot. That that's that's where in the video she was sleeping. 100%. She was sleeping here, right there. Okay, 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 okay. So we, we're gonna sit there, and this is the perfect place to summon my wife. All right. I actually don't know if I have any pity. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty. Five, thirty, five, forty, five, fifty, fifty-five. I'm at fifty-seven. Yeah, because I pulled to get some uh, some four stars. I think I wanted some Layla copies. I think was it for Layla's? No, was I just unlucky and I didn't get a Chevrose? It might have been for Chevrose, Lynette. Chevrose. Yeah, I wanted a Chevrose, and it took me, like, a long time. Okay, so I am at 57 PD. <sighs> okay. Let's freaking go! 67! Yo! Let's go! Come on! It has to be her! Come on! Come on! Oh my god, come on! Please, 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 please,
Oh my god, it's insane. That is absolutely bananas. I'm not even mad if I go to hard pity. Like, I, at this point... Yo, Cookie Constellation, let's go! I, I can't... Jesus! And the new weapon? Hell freaking yeah! And the new weapon! Oh my god. And I didn't even have enough Constellation here, so it's a full win. Okay, 20 pity. I kind of want the, the new sword weapon. Okay, sacrificial great sword, whatever. All right, sacrificial great sword is a bit disappointing in general. Okay, thirty pity because like there's just not that many good claymore. But I mean maybe Mavuika will be able to use it properly, right, as a support. Okay, more consul more refinement for the new weapon. That's kind of cool. This weapon is kind of good, right? I need to check the detail for it. I'm not sure. new weapon insane so that was 30 pd or 40 pd i don't even remember I don't, i'm so excited i just don't remember uh yeah this one yes i was talking about this one this one is it's an energy recharge the energy recharge is on the same level as um favonius lens except that favonius lens you can build some crits and get some extra particles right which is obviously very good but you need to build crits here you don't have the extra particle but in exchange um, you deal more energy skill damage. And it's also a buff. Uh, wait, no, it's only for you, right? Uh, elemental skill damage increased by 12%. After other nearby party members use elemental skills, the equipping character's elemental skill damage will also increase by 12%. So this is awesome. So it's kind of like a, a support energy recharge weapon, but like if you don't need extra particle um, on top of it, you can definitely uh, build this one instead if you want more damage on your support, for example. So this weapon is actually very good. And here it's attack percentage. Um, after using sprint, alternate sprint, normal attack damage increased by 16% of uh, attack. This effect is power after triggering 18 times or 7 seconds. Uh, this is okay. Um, but it also has the effect of um, sprint to alternate sprint, 7 that consumption is decreased. Uh, which could work for... Well, Shilodan, for example, right? Although it's, it, it scales off of attack, which is not the best stat for, for her. But it can certainly be useful for future characters and whatnot. Okay, uh, so I think we are 30 pity, I think. Or 40, one of those two. I think it's 30. So now it's 4. <gasps> oh, and I get her at 40 pity! Oh my god! 10, 20, and 40 pity! With freaking 60 pulls! With 60 pulls, I get Chilonen, her weapon, and Chiori's weapon. Absolutely insane. <laughs> that is crazy. <laughs> it's, yo, it's Arlequino all over again, literally. Although with Arlequino, I did pull for a constellation. This is bananas. This is simply insane. What the freak? I... Oh my god! Uh, okay! Well, uh, yeah! Okay! Well, good job, chat! And I still have 58 pulls plus the 32. Uh, so I still have 90 pulls. I still have like 93 or 94 pulls. So like, this is the best possible outcome for me. I still have enough pull for potentially Chaska or Mavuika. Uh... I'm so sorry because I feel like I've been incredibly lucky and I, I don't know if I deserve it. <laughs> but I'll certainly take it. Holy crap. Holy crap. Yeah, he had 39 pulls. So 39 plus the 63 I have. Uh, 71, 101 pulls still available. All right, let's have a look, Cs. So... This is the little part of the, the, the guide. This is the, the small, quick and dirty guide. Because I kind of want to give, like, some my... Oh, that's... Oh, I have no constellation of my cookie. Okay. Uh, so, what I would recommend for her. Obviously, if you have a weapon, this is going to be her best in slot. 
Uh, it's mostly going to be your basin slot, both as a support as well as a DPS. If you don't have a weapon, you can definitely use Uraku Misugu Misuguri. Um, it's the second best for DPS purposes, if you do want to play as a DPS. Do keep in mind, she's not a fantastic, like, mind-breaking DPS, but she's definitely serviceable. Um, so especially if you want to use her um, on the overworld as, like, a DPS for when you want to explore, she can definitely, definitely work. But otherwise, she's obviously better as a support. So um, as a support, the Pit Patrol song is going to be the best option. Um, afterward, it kind of depends. You have multiple options. Either you do go for a weapon that scales off of defense, um, and in that case, it's going to be... I believe it's the flute. It's the new weapon from the region. Do I not have it? I guess I don't have it. I thought they gave it for free, but maybe it was the other weapon. Anyway, it's like the craftable from this region that works well for her. But you can obviously... Um, use a Favonius Sword for energy recharge that's going to be very, very effective on her. So those two are the options. If you want to play her as a DPS, you can go for a main weapon, you can go for Chiri's weapon, or you can go for um, the Wind Sword. I don't remember the name. I don't have it. I'm sorry, but I'm sure you'll figure it out. Otherwise, the flute is also a good option for DPS because it scales up defense, I'm pretty sure. Uh, so those are the options. Now, in terms of what you want to build, it's very simple. If you want her to be a DPS, you're going to be using the Obsidian Codex. If you want her to be a support, you are going to build her with the Hero of Sinner City or whatever it's named. I never remember the order. This is the one. Scroll of the Hero of Sinner City. There it is. So this one is obviously going to be very good. It's the 40%, like, uh, it's the massive damage buff for the team. Uh, this is absolutely bananas. For her, you want... Um, for her, you want a little bit of energy recharge if you want to ulti as often as possible, especially if she's the only healer of your team and you're playing her with a character like Farina, for example. You want to make sure that you have ulti every single rotation to get those stacks, right? Uh, so in that in those circumstances, you definitely want to have enough energy recharge. If not, you want to go for um, crit rate, crit damage, defense percentage. Um, that's pretty much it. You you can go for some, um, maybe a little bit of elemental mastery. I, I don't think it's the most important thing. Some flat defense can be useful also. Uh, so that's for the substat. Now for the main stat, generally speaking, you're going to want to go for a crit headpiece. The reason is that if you are playing her as a support, you probably have the Favonius Sword on her. And so the energy recharge is going to be useful. Uh, the crit is going to allow you to, you know, proc the Favonius Sword. Um, otherwise... I guess you can use defense or healing uh, bonus, that's okay. Uh, I would say healing bonus is probably the best option if you're not going for crit. If you're playing her as a DPS, crit is obviously going to be what you want for the circlet. Now, for the goblet, you have multiple options. Um, if you really need it, uh, defense is going to be the best option here. If you want to be more, if you want more damage, a geo is going to be a good option as well. Uh, and for the sends, you either want, um, you, you pretty much just want defense percentage. But if you need it, if you're really lacking, you can definitely go for energy recharge instead. That is a option. Uh, so those are what you want to go for. Now for what I am going to be getting here, I do want to be able to have the support for now. And I'm probably going to end up, as you can see, uh, unfortunately, I have a crit, uh, crit damage here. Uh, this would need to be crit rate. Uh, so for now, I'm going to be using something else, which is this one. It's a defense percentage with crit rate and crit damage there, which is pretty good. Uh, this one has a little bit of energy recharge, but like a lot of the other stats are not very interesting. So this is the one I'm going to go for for now. Uh, here we have a geo damage bonus with some defense percentage, energy recharge, elemental mastery. This is pretty good. Uh, but I also have the option to go for defense percentage. Um, this one also has a little bit of energy recharge and crit rate, which is pretty good. Uh, one of the two is going to be a good option. I feel like 
If I want a bit more damage, I could go for this. Uh, the energy recharge is not bad either. Uh, but the defense would be uh, a very good option. What I'm going to do personally is I'm going to put some defense. And then depending on how much defense I get, because you basically want 3200 3, for the weapon buff. Uh, once I reach that cap, if I'm way higher, I'm going to change my pieces. I'm going to change this piece for the Geo one instead. Uh, because I won't need that much defense essentially. Now here... I've got an energy recharge one. This is not the best thing you want. The crit rate is absolutely crazy though. So maybe I'll use this one just because I literally have a 17% crit rate, which is bananas. Um, so that's potentially what I want. Um, because I have the weapon, maybe I don't need a defense uh, sense here. So maybe I go for that. Uh, but I'm not entirely sure yet. Here I've got 12% defense, a bit of energy recharge. Uh, but I could go for some, like, crit damage defense here. Crit rate, auto mastery, energy recharge. I, I don't have something, like, very, very good here. So I'm still kind of considering my options. And here, this piece is insane. I've got 20% crit damage, 6.6% crit rate, defense, energy recharge. This piece is absolutely bananas. So here, my two options is either I go for this, and then I try to fish a plume that's going to be better. Or I pick this one, and I get a goblet that's going to be, like, geo percentage essentially so here i'm gonna try to use this one and here we're gonna go for anything else that has uh let's say crit rate crit damage maybe some defense percentage do i have something like that uh I, 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 so i do but i'm using them i could take this away from ganyu i guess that 12 percent is crazy crazy um crit rates crit damage defense percentage and no one's using it, so I might grab this one. Uh, crit, crit, crit damage, uh, HP. All of those are HP for some reason. I'll I'll just equip this one, um, and I can level them up probably to level twenty. I feel like this piece is pretty good. I'm out of XP material. No, we're still good. There we go. There we go. Okay, defense flat, obviously not the best. Still works for her to some extent. So it could have definitely been worse. Uh, here we are getting more energy recharge, which is nice. And for the circlet, I am getting more crit rate, which is absolutely awesome. So here, I don't know how that's going to end up looking for my artifact. I am getting 47% crit rate, 42% crit damage, which obviously... Uh, that's okay. This is still, in terms of just artifact, this is basically a, you know, like 140 crit value, which is pretty good. 71% energy recharge is very nice. Um, so overall, this is not bad. Uh, this is not bad at all. So in terms of final attribute, uh, 52 to 92, obviously not awesome. And my defense is very low, but that's basically because she's level 1. I'm going to be leveling her up. But yeah, that's basically what I would recommend for her. Uh, let me know in the comments if your pool went well. I hope it was nice. Thank you so much for watching this. And you can catch me live on twitch.tv forward slash I'll see you there. Cheers!